If you're gonna be hitting golf balls off a mat in a simulator this winter, then you need these. What's happening, Panda Nation? Peter Von Panda here. Now, I picked up these little cage tees. They're kind of called bird cage tees sometimes, but I picked them up by Craft. 17 pieces because that was a lot of tees for the smallest price I could find. They actually have some kind of big name brands in this space, but <laughs> what am I, made of money? I just squeezed my gut and I'm not made of money. I'm made of flesh and blood. So I thought I would check these out. I also think that because they're kind of light, they may not last forever either. And so I didn't want to spend any more money on them than I needed to. Now, I want to quick show them to you and then hit them and see what we think. You know, generally they are going to be pretty light. And one of the reasons I like that is that the heavier rubber ones that I have used in the past, one, you can feel it when you hit them with your driver or club, you know, the real short ones you might be using with some irons to practice teeing up the ball on a short par three or something like that. But these are so much lighter when you hit them, they kind of don't go because these are so much lighter when you hit them, you don't really feel them. So that's really nice. Now you can see here, it's kind of a plastic, pretty thin, pretty light. It's kind of like a little shuttlecock. You can see we have the little flanges here, the serrations, so it will sit up. And then what we can do here is put our ball right on top, right? So I can put it up there. This one is really tall. So it's like an inch and three quarters or something. This green one or this yellow one seems like the same height. If I look in here, I guess maybe there's some subtle differences, but these over here are much shorter. So you can see that these are maybe only half or three quarter inch tall so they will sit like that so you put that there um i'm actually looking at all of these and i'm kind of realizing the different colors here actually look like they're all about the same height so if this is too tall for you then you might want some that have more graduation in the heights because these all seem pretty tall and i will tell you what putting the ball on there that is a little higher than normal for me so if you tee it up really high you might like these little bird cage tees but if you don't tee it up very high you know maybe just one ball height high you know if i show you here so this is pretty high it's pretty much one ball height off of the ground that's probably not that bad that's probably pretty typical so i think this is going to work for a lot of people but i would definitely say that your preference is probably to tee it up high i know a lot of people might like teeing it a little lower because it helps them a little lower on the club feet so just depends what you want but we get a ton of tees here so if you're hitting indoors especially this winter or in your garage into the net or even off the mats at the driving range i think something like this might make your life a lot easier and keep you from breaking the bank on more expensive ones that break or fly away so if you want to pick these up i'll put a link to them in the description below peter von panda out we can discover more and explore so much deeper